Okay guys, enjoying watching us react to these Naruto clips? If so, please use the link in the video's description and support Masashi Kishimoto and all official Naruto releases. Thanks guys! Okay guys, now that our good pal Shikamaru has helped Naruto to certainly come to grips with uh, Pervy Sage's passing, I'm real interested to see where things move from here. Plus, I, I, I'm curious too, I want to see if they're going to solve the whole uh, inscription on <laughs> on uh, Pa Toad there, on uh, Toda, so we can find out exactly what Jiraiya's message was, because he seemed, I mean, when he passed, he certainly seemed very comfortable in the fact that whatever message he was sending was going to be of great value. So I, I, I'm hoping they, they cover that pretty soon. Plus now we've got Sasuke out there bent on vengeance. <laughs> what? Sasuke bent on vengeance? I know it's hard to believe, you know, that Sasuke would be constantly, uh, or at any point, it's hard to believe that Sasuke would be consumed with revenge, but apparently he is. So Naruto and he, I would assume, are going to cross paths at some point, and it's going to get interesting. So let's let's see what's next. His life, so he could leave us this coded message. Yeah. He bequeathed the future to all of you. All right, this frog that I'm giving to you supposedly contains a captured hidden rain ninja. Yes, I received prior notice from Jiraiya. All right, expand to full size. And be as rough as you need to be. Get everything out of him. Ah, yeah. <laughs> that a girl, Tsunade. <laughs> Fuck this, this rain is ninja. one of the three crucial sources of Creepy. data that Jiraiya left us. You've been really quiet for a while. Do you notice anything? So why is there one katakana letter among all of them? Huh? Katakana letter? Where do you see that? See, right here. Wherever we went, he always made me read his handwritten drafts and ask me what I thought about them. They were really boring, though. <laughs> Too much titties? <laughs> huh? What's this? I forgot about that. It's Sleep hat. Katics. The whole thing ends up looking like the number nine. Found it. No, let's see. All right, this now you got is the, a sample of Jiraiya's handwriting. You got the eggs, eggheads on board. There it is. It's the same. Jiraiya planned this. He knew that Naruto would remember this idiosyncrasy of his. That he wrote the katakana ta like a nine. So frankly, that was the link between Jiraiya and Naruto. We finally figured it out. <sighs> what were you thinking, Naruto? Why didn't you mention such an important thing sooner? <laughs> What's the big deal about knowing that it's the letter ta? Sheesh. <laughs> the numbers in the code probably represent a word order, or number of lines, or, page or even page numbers. Page numbers it's and stuff. Related to the yeah. Key. Naruto, which book were you reading? Uh, oh boy. <laughs> make out something. What was it? Okay, then just tell me how many of Jiraiya's books. Make out something that. I'm not sure. If I don't narrow it down. Four or five, maybe. Good. That's not too many. We'll just have to check all of them. It's probably huh? this one. Oh, that's right. Kakashi would have them all memorized. Well, yeah. Ah. <laughs> Kakashi Sensei. Yeah, that's right. That's the same one that Pervy Sage was working on all the time during our training. <laughs> I didn't even think about that, Kakashi. That's something else only Naruto would have known. Kakashi just has a I thought Lord Jiraiya did dry a books Robodex in his brain. Mm -hmm. This Ta is the first character in the code. Of all Jiraiya's books, this is the only title with a word that begins with Ta. First, we look at what the first letter or word on that page is. Please, read the first sentence Hot out nerd loud. too here. What? She needs some uh, D, I think. She's a little uh, uptight. <laughs> no, I, I, I mean... Uh, look, what is Come the on, Kashi-sensei, read it. Hurry up and read it already! <laughs> <laughs> Is it about titties? Come on, spit it out, would ya? <laughs> really? I <laughs> love you. 
If I read the first character from each page of the book in order... The real ones, not among them. That's what it says. The real pain is not among the... What does that mean? No idea. Yeah, please do, Shiho. Right, thank you. She Let's the hoe. We gotta tell Grandma Tsunade what we found out. She the hoe. I like that. I like that name. Um, the so, real ones, not among them. So the real pain is not among them. So... Geezer Sage. What do you think? Does it make sense to you? Actually, none of those six really remind me of Nagato all that That's what I was going to say. It's got to be Nagato, right? Yet, a completely unrelated pain knew of a conversation that the Rinnegan bearing Nagato and I shared alone. The faces are different, but I definitely sense Nagato in them. I will avenge Pervy Sage. There we go. I can't just sit around here doing nothing. But listen, Naruto boy. Now that we've deciphered the coded message, there's nothing else going on that involves Now Naruto you. and Sasuke. So what about it? What are on you the vengeance to say? trail. You're definitely not strong enough to defeat pain yet. What did you say? You know I'm right. Even Jiraiya boy couldn't defeat him. And if he couldn't, you think you could? Well, guess not. If you were to fight him now, you would merely die a senseless death. So what are you saying, Geezer Sage? Geezer I should just Sage. totally forget about avenging the pervy Sage? I've said no such thing. Being asked to come here was quite opportune. You see, for a long time I've been planning on coming to speak with you, Naruto boy. Huh? Tell me then. Do you want to come and train in Sage I, Jutsu under my I was just going to say, he's going to get some... Sage Jutsu? I see. Naruto learning Sage Jutsu. He's going to get some Good Toda thing. knowledge. Is Sage Jutsu really that awesome? Yes. Hmm. Jiraiya was the only one capable of using it in this village. I'm as furious as you. I too want to avenge the death of my student wow. Jiraiya boy. Got pop pissed off. That the only one who can do that is you, Naruto boy. What, me? You do want to avenge Jiraiya boy, don't you? You better believe I do. Then come along with me now. I'll teach you Sage Jutsu at Mount Nioboku. The same way I hammered it into Jiraiya, boy, I'll hammer it into you, if that's okay. Will it let me win? Could I stop pain? No guarantees. It all depends on you, Naruto boy. Oh, it's gonna be good. Are you all right with this? Yes, of course. Good luck, Naruto. Thanks. All right. Now let's go! You guys know where Mount Miyaboku is? Because <laughs> I don't. Because I don't. He's supposed to save us? We're all safe. <laughs> it takes a month to fun. get there on foot. It's also <laughs> known as Maze Mountain, because if you don't know the secret route, you won't be able to get there. Uh, why does this place have to be so hard to reach? Good what? luck on your end of things as well. Now then, let's concentrate Quick way to get there. out the information Jiraiya left us. Roger that. Roger, roger. The fact that the great Lord Elder prophesied Jiraiya writing those books may have been intended to enable him to eventually leave the encrypted message, meaning that the prophecy... Oh, be yeah! Dead. In which case, Naruto Uzumaki truly is the child of prophecy. Yeah, no, I, completely, I completely forgot about that. That Jiraiya was initially told to become a... to walk you know, walk the world and, and write the books. That's right. I forgot about that. Where am I? No way. <clears throat> Geezer Sage, where are we? We are in the land of toads. Land of toads? Naruto! Hey, hey! <laughs> Kamikichi! Yeah, I was the one who summoned you here to this place. Welcome. Oh, I get it. That's how I got here. Before we begin training, we must eat. Come along. Uh, he's not gonna have to Dude? eat flies, is he? Uh huh. And bugs. All right, now eat your fill. There's my extra effort into making this meal. No, no, don't be shy. Try the caterpillars; they're delicious. Ugh. Thank you, ma'am. <laughs> ah, dude. <laughs> mm. 
You should have brought some food with you. First of all, I must explain to you that what I'm about to teach you is not ninjutsu, but sage jutsu, and there's a big difference between them. So what is it? Listen. As opposed to ninjutsu, this is where you utilize internal energy, sage jutsu involves making use of outside energy. Outside? What does that mean? As you probably know, the way one performs ninjutsu is by manipulating chakra that is created from mixing one's mental and physical energies together. Now with sage jutsu, it involves taking all of that internally generated chakra and adding to it nature energy from the outside, resulting in an this, even more powerful chakra. This is cool. I love their explanations for these things. Ninjutsu, genjutsu, and even your taijutsu getting a really serious power boost. Mental energy and physical energy from within you, and nature energy from the outside. The jutsu and other techniques that are born from the chakra created when these three energies are mixed together are called sage jutsu. It's interesting to watch both sakura, er, sakura. Naruto and adding a mint swirl to chocolate and vanilla soft serve makes it even more delicious. Yeah. Why didn't they give them that deep? Watching Naruto and Sasuke keep getting their individual trainings, keep moving ahead. But back to this whole nature energy thing. What is that all about exactly? This should be good enough. Wow. Lord Fukasaku's amazing. Look at him gather all of that nature energy. Eh? But where? I don't... Whoa. Damn. He... He lifted that thing? Not a bad lift for a... What do you think? Little senior what citizen frog. What is the fearsome power of nature energy enhanced sage jutsu. <sighs> <laughs> but I don't have any idea how you just did that. Except that I saw you weave a hand sign at the beginning of it. Well, naturally, you don't see. You're not yet able to sense nature energy, Naruto boy. Naruto boy, I like that. Nor can you take any of it into yourself yet. Then how do I do it? Don't kill yourself, Pop. What you do is become one with nature. How do I do that? Basically, he means that you're gonna have to die. How do I do that? What? Oh, oh, that sucks. Oh, well, shit. <laughs> oh, oh, well. <laughs> I just, I, I just love the the way it's put out there. So, uh, you know, simply and bluntly, well, you gotta die first, and then you know, training after that, training gets much easier once you're dead. Th this is good. I, I like watching the training sequences and stuff. I know. I know they, they lag a little for some people, but I, I I like watching the training. It sets, for me, it sets up the eventual showdowns, all that much more when you know what went into it. Like I say, watching, you know, all the different things that Sasuke's encountered as far as his training, all the gains, things that Naruto has put himself through for his training, and knowing that at some point, those two things got to meet. But I don't know, it just seems like especially after some of the conversations around the, the eight tails and things like that, it seems like to me, and again, this is uh, just from what I've seen so far. Well, I shouldn't say that. I think, it, I think it's probably pretty obvious that until Naruto can learn to control the nine tails, I don't think he has much of a chance against, if not pain, certainly Madara. But in any event, I like, I like watching Toda train. I need a Toda in my life.